there is a true spiritual awakening in the world and also there is false spiritual awakening. Just the way you see true revival where true prophets or true men and women of God are being used, the devil also crafts and have his false prophets to have a fake revival. This spiritual awakening, it is true, it's there. But the devil has crafted his own spiritual awakening. People are being lied to so that they can start worshipping their ancestors, so that they can start worshipping facing on certain mountains. I'm not saying people shouldn't go to the mountains, but whatever is happening right now, you as an individual, especially if you are a believer, be careful not to fall into the trap of false prophets. You hear people saying that all the generation of the earth currently are a generation of Anunnaki. When you read the book, the Bible, Numbers chapter 13, verse 22, you find out that those generation was there. They call it Anunnaki or Anunnaki. Also, when you read Genesis chapter 6, you find out that there were Nephilims. There were angels, fallen angels who came to the earth, put their seed into women, and a certain generation was born. Later, during Noah's flood, something happened. Majority of those generation died. But some of them were found even after the flood, during the time of Moses. So when you hear people saying that we are from the generation of Anak, that's the lie. Though there are people who are from the generation of Anak, some of them are leaders, some of them are influencers. So be very careful not to fall into this trap. Not everybody you see out there, outside there have full human DNA. Some have DNA of these spirits. 